Hello, everyone. I am Dustin Childs, Head of Threat Awareness here at Trend Micro Zero Day Initiative. And with me is Brian Gorenz. He is the VP of Threat Research. Uh, Brian, how are we doing today? Doing good, doing good. We are here in Tokyo to celebrate the second ever Pwned Own Automotive. And we may or may not be live. Well, we are we, live. We are live. <laughs> okay, so th that's good. Hey, you know what? Let's do it live. <laughs> so anyway, we uh, are here for our second annual Pwned Own Automotive con uh, Conference. And uh, Brian, what can we expect this year? Uh, it's going to be an exciting, uh, exciting contest this year. I think we have what a 50 entries in the competition with uh, 21 teams from all over the world. I think yeah. over a dozen countries over coming dozen here countries. Yeah, in Japan great. to uh, participate. Uh, you know, we've got a lot of EV chargers that are going to be under test, and you know, IVIs and operating systems. It should be a lot of fun, including the Tesla ball connector. I'm happy yes. to see that one uh, go under uh, under test to see what we get there. And uh, especially with the EV chargers, I want to talk about the special challenge that we have this year with the connectors and the communications through the connectors. Yeah, correct. We uh, this year we wanted to incentivize uh, kind of having uh, the contestants manipulate the signals going out of the charge connector. Um, and also we wanted to incentivize attacks that were gonna be starting from the charge connector into the EV charger itself, um, just to kind of give a little extra flair and, and advance the research in this area. Uh, and we think we're gonna have some interesting entries there this year. Yeah, I, I'm really looking forward to it. So we have our box. We've had uh, a couple comments that maybe we're not as random as we could be when it comes to the draw, but I promise you, we are as random as we could possibly be. We'll mix it up all the way around and 50 entries. So we have to get through. So, Brian, why don't you go ahead and kick us off? Yeah, and, let's and, go. And let's dig, see who's dig up in first. here. First up at Pwn to Own Automotive, we have Synactive targeting the charge point home flex uh, EV charger uh, for $60,000 and six master of home points. Okay, I'll hand that to my beautiful assistant off stage. Okay. Oh, it's stuck in there. Yeah, okay. Up next, we have PHP Hooligans targeting the Altel Ma Maxi Charger uh, for fifty thousand and five Master of Phone. Nice. Points. Good to have them back yep. at the competition. They Synactive do have a great name. And, Synactive and PHP Hooligans. All right, we just got to pull one out of the time. Just one. Here we go. This one. All right. Next up, we have P uh, PC Automotive targeting the Alpine device IVI. For twenty thousand dollars and two master opponent points. Yes, a lot of people are targeting those in-vehicle infotainment systems. They're a very popular choice. Uh, let's see who's next. Next up, we have uh, Viatel Cybersecurity targeting the Kenwood DMX nine eight five XR MLP uh, <laughs> in the IVI category. All right, let's see here. We'll dig in this box. All right, next up, we'll have Viatel Cybersecurity again targeting the Alpine IVI. Uh, for twenty thousand dollars and two master opponent points. Great. Let's see. Come on. Really? Okay. Next up, we have Sina uh, Kirka of the summoning team targeting the Phoenix Contact in the yes. EV charger category for fifty thousand dollars. Yeah, last year at the competition, Phoenix Contact had several entries, but they fixed them really, really quickly. So it was good to see that in this industry, a nice response from them last year. Hopefully, we'll get the same this time. We have. Uh, Tobias uh, from Fuzzware, uh, Tobias and team from Fuzzware IO targeting the Autel Maxi uh, Charger AC wall box commercial uh, in the EV charging category for 50,000 points, five master opponent points. Easy for you to say. Yeah, I know. Well, let's see what's next here. One at a time. There we go. Oh, oh, just one. Just one. Just one. Uh, Cena is back targeting the Ubiquity Connect EV station. Last year, he rickrolled everyone on the Ubiquity. So uh, let's see what he has yeah, for us I'm sure, this year. I'm sure he'll bring some style points into mm -hmm. the competition. He always does. All right, next up, we'll take this one here. All right, uh, Quartz Lab targeting the Autel Maxi Charger as well in the EV charging category for $50,000 and five master opponent points. Okay. All righty. Oh, it's a big one. Uh, let's see. We have Kong Kang and Nam Dong of uh, Antud. I don't know how you say A-N-H-T-U-D. But they will be targeting the Sony IVI for 20,000 and two Master of Phone points. All right. Here we go. Next up. We have GMO Cybersecurity uh, targeting the Kenwood IVI for $20,000 and two Master of Phone points. I believe they're one of our Japanese competitors. I think so, they? yes. That's great. So we have two Japanese competitors in this year's event. So that's awesome. We are in Tokyo. Did I mention we're in Tokyo? We are in Tokyo. We are in Tokyo. <laughs> you can tell I'm in Tokyo because there's Godzilla. Um, oh, 
phone's upside down. Uh, team, so Team Confused uh, up next, also targeting the Sony IVI for 20000 Team Confused. Some great names this year in the competition. I was confused because it was upside down. <laughs> Viatel Cybersecurity back at it again with charge targeting ChargePoint in the EV charging category for $50,000 and four master, five master bone points. Go. I feel like there's another 40 or so in here, but I guess there are. <laughs> okay. Uh, um, next, uh, Cena comes back. This time with the Altel Maxi Charger AC wall box for 50,000 and five master phone points. Nice. All right. Next up, we have Rob and Andreas from Technical Debt Collectors targeting automotive grade Linux in the uh, operating system category. So, all right. 15 down, 35 to go. Woo, here we go. All right. Technical stay, Debt stay Collectors. With, stay. Techn is that awesome? That's a great, a great name. name. Yeah, great name. Okay. Uh, Tobias, uh, Schwarnowski, Felix, Kristen, and the other folks at Fudsworth IO targeting Phoenix Contact uh, in the EV Charger category. Yeah, they've you know those guys they have a, you know really good training and they also uh, participated last year in the competition. Uh, excited to see them back this year uh, again. Uh, Fuzzware IO targeting this ChargePoint HomeFlex uh, EV Charger in the EV Charging category for fifty thousand dollars and five Master of Home points. It was a big box. <laughs> this is a skinny one. Uh, the PHP Hooligan starting the Tesla wall connector. Nice. So I think that's the first one of those. So we'll see the PHP Hooligans, uh, what they can do on the Tesla yeah. wall connector. Yes. Next up after that is, uh, let's see, EQTST Lab targeting the Alpine in the IVI category for $20,000. And two master of home points. Wasn't it the uh, Alpine that the NCC group put uh, Doom yes, on last yeah, year? Yeah, last year when uh, NCC compromised uh, the Alpine. I was playing Doom on the stage here at the yeah. Tokyo Big Site. It was a lot of fun. Uh, next up, Synactive will be targeting the Kenwood IVI for 20000 and two master of home points. All right, next up. HT3 Labs targeting the Phoenix contact device in the EV charging category for $50,000 and five master opponent points. Okay. I'm, I'm stuck. Hang on. Okay. There we go. <laughs> right. Okay. The Zion Inc. Uh, people, there's a lot of them, and I'm just going to mispronounce all of their names. So I'm just going to say Zien, Z I E N. They will be targeting the Kenwood and the IVI category for $20,000. Lots of new teams in this year's competition. We're excited to see that, uh, you know, always having new people coming out and participating here with us. Uh, next up is uh, Cena from Summoning Team targeting the Sony IVI for $20,000 and two Master of Poem points. Yes, and I'm getting a message that I, I don't quite understand, but apparently the Synactive Charge Point had the uh, signal manip manipulation add-on. Yes, for so, the very first draw. For the very first draw. So I just wanted to clarify that in case they're watching and we're confused. Don't worry, it's just me. It's not you. <laughs> I, I am the confused one. Okay, next up we have the team from PC Automotive targeting the Tesla wall connector uh, with signal manipulation. Nice. I uh, remembered it this time. That's going to be so, fun. Yeah, that should be great. Got the Tesla team out here supporting us this year as yep. well, so that's always good. Uh, next up is uh, Fuzzware IO targeting the Emporia EV Charger Level Two uh, in the EV charging mm -hmm. category for fifty thousand dollars and five Master of Home points. That's the first Emporia entry. I've yes, seen. yeah, yes. that's cool. I think they targeted last year too, so oh, should be good. It's probably the same bug. <laughs> it could be. Could be. <laughs> Let's see. Next, we have Synactive targeting the Altel Maxi Charger again with uh, the connector protocol signal manipulation add-on. For a whole bunch of money and six master bonus. Nice, sixty thousand. Yeah. 60 All right. Grand. Next up. Next up. All right. We are more than halfway there. More than halfway. Synactive back back at it again, targeting the Tesla wall connector in the EV charging category, uh, with a charging connector attack add-on for seventy thousand and seven master of home points. Nice. Which is awesome. So they're going to be targeting. They're going to be targeting the e a Tesla wall connector from the from the charge connector itself. Uh, that's going to be super interesting. You if you're at the show, if you're here in Japan, you should come and see that entry. Uh, we actually have uh, like a little car. That it plugs into that uh, one of our guys made. I call it the Ikane model because <laughs> that means it doesn't go in Jap Japanese. So, uh, but yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. Uh, next, we have uh, Stealin targeting the Alpine 
uh, in the IVI category. Keep digging in here. So, next up, hydrate. Steel in targeting the Ubiquity Connect EV charging station uh, in the EV charging category for, uh, oh, along with the sig uh, charging connector protocol signal, signal manipulation add on for $60,000 and six master foam points. That's cool. Glad to see yeah. so many of those protocol manipulation bugs. Yeah, we're quite, quite interested in to see how those attacks pan out. If there's any, you know, pivoting that they have to do inside of the EV charger to see if they can get to the, the power system. We'll, we'll find out this week in the, in the disclosure rooms. Okay, up next is Cena uh, targeting the Wolfbox level two EV charger for fifty thousand and five master yep. phone points. It's the first year for Wolfbox in the competition. Well, you know, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how the disclosures go. Uh, yep. Should be should be good. For Always them. interesting. Uh, next up, Pony seventy four targeting the Kenwood IVI for twenty thousand dollars and two master phone points. Groovy. Vincent is frantically trying to write down all the numbers <laughs> off screen. Making sure we stay in order. And up next, uh, we have the Anthud team again, targeting the Alpine in the IVI category. It's good to have those guys back out of the competition. Yep. All right, next up, we have Cena. Cena's in this competition a lot this he's year, lot. targeting the Kenwood IVI, $20,000, two master opponent points. He said he's brought the heat this year, so we're hoping to see him be successful many, many, many yep. times. He might get master opponent this time. We'll see. Time to get ready. Next up, we have uh, GMO cybersecurity targeting the Alpine in the IVI category. All right, next up, we have we have PC Automotive targeting the Sony IVI uh, it, for twenty thousand dollars and two master of home points. Okay. A lot of a lot of good entries in the IVI category this year. Yep. All right. We have VHL Cybersecurity targeting the Sony IVI. So, again, lots of good entries. A lot of good entries. Yeah. VHL has brought a, a lot of research, too. Yes. Yeah. All right. I owe them a hat as well. But <laughs> I did bring them a hat uh, that I will provide them at the contest. All right. Uh, Raffle from Pixie Point Security targeting the Wolfbox level two EV charger in the EV charging category for $50,000, five master opponent points. Cool. Getting there, getting there. Getting there. Almost down. I have to hunt a little now for one. Okay. It's just one. And it is Cena targeting the Tesla wall connector for $50,000. Uh, you know, first year for to have the wall connector in the competition. We had lots of people targeting it uh, this year. Um, so there should be a lot of really interesting findings. The CIS team targeting the Alpine in the IVI category for $20,000 and two master of home points. Okay. That's right. We are live on the air and people just randomly open the door to the room. So it's exciting. <laughs> you never know what's going to happen. Godzilla could come right through. Uh, next up is PHP Hooligans targeting the Wolf Box for 50,000 and five master opponent points. All right. Next up, just one. All right. Compass Security targeting the Alpine in the IVI category for $20,000 and two master of home points. Great. We are under 10 to go. That's right. So, okay. Up next, uh, we have Jurin Oi, Elias, Apo, Oxman, and uh, targeting the Kenwood in the uh, IVI category. It's good to have Apo in the competition. Yep. All right, next up, uh, we have Synactive targeting the Sony in the IVI category for $20,000, two master of home points. Yeah, we are on the home stretch. Keep pulling. Keep pulling. Okay. Next, we have PHP Hooligans targeting the Kenwood uh, in the IVI category. Let's right. see them come back with a bunch yeah. of stuff, too. All right, I'll turn it over. Uh, Than Du from Team Confused targeting the Alpine in the IVI category for $20,000 and two master opponent points. There we go. You definitely have to hunt around. For yeah, I know. It's getting, getting, getting a little bare. Uh, Tobias, Felix, and Christian from Fuzzware.io targeting the Wolf Box uh, for $50,000. All right, we'll get this one here. Cena 
from the uh, of summoning team t uh, targeting the charge point home flex in the EV charging category for fifty thousand dollars and five master of home points. Okay, that should be forty seven. There should be three more left. Okay, up next we have Rob Blakely and Andres Comzano of Technical Debt Collectors yeah. targeting the Tesla wall connector in the EV charger category. Got it. Yeah. All right. Uh, Kenwood, uh, or sorry, Evan Grant targeting the Kenwood in the IVI category for $20,000 and two master of home points. Okay, and this is should be our last one. You gotta find it in there. I gotta find it. Oh, oh, I got it. I got it. <laughs> We're giving oh. Vincent a heart attack off screen. Here. A little tricky. <laughs> like, giving me a heart attack too with my hand in the box. And the final entry is Cena from Summoning Team targeting the Alpine in the IVI category. And that, folks, is a show. We are super excited about all of the uh, contestants and all the research they're going to bring. We are at Automotive World in Tokyo. Registration is free. So all you have to do is register for the show and then show up and watch if you want. Uh, if not, stay tuned on YouTube, on Twitter, on Blue Sky, on Instagram, on Mastodon, uh, maybe on LinkedIn, possibly with smoke signals. We're going to be putting <laughs> out uh, all of the results as we get them. So please stay tuned for that. And with that, Brian, anything else we want to add? No, we're excited. We're this year, like obviously, we're partnering with uh, Vic One uh, and, and Trim Micro here to uh, to bring this competition to bear. And uh, you know, again, we're excited for all the people who've come out uh, to to work with us, and uh, we're looking forward to a good show. It should be exciting. Lots of cool stuff uh, to be presented this year. Yeah, it's uh, going to be three great days of really, really some of the world's best automotive hacking. So we hope to see you there. And until then, uh, just stay tuned for the results. So this is Dustin saying, catch you at the show.